welcome back to our youtube channel don't forget to like share and comment on this video so in the last video i taught you on how to sublimate t-shirt so look at this this is already sublimated t-shirt and now i want to blink already sublimated t-shirt with my rhinestone so this rhinestone will call it million pattern board i use million pattern board to lift this stone by the time I stone this outfit, so oh, you will love it. So, come, 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 come close. So I'm going to trace, look at the picture. I'm not just going to bling it anyhow. I want to trace this picture. I don't want my stone to be here, to be here, to be here. I just want my stone to be on the picture. So I'm going to, so I will not remove this protect, um, protect sheet. I will use this protective to trim, you know, this is, this is, um, what, what am I going to call it? I want to construct, I want to construct something on this picture. So I'm going to use my scissor to trace every part that, that I don't need so that the stone will, the right stone will only be on the picture, it will not be on the outfit because I want it to stand out. So follow me. This is my scissors. Fian, fian, fian. So let's let's trim. Please be careful while you are trimming, so that you will not cut your outfit. This has happened to me countless times. I will cut it. I will start looking for. How am I going to sew it back? So you need to be very very careful. So you cut. Please be careful. Make sure you are not cutting your t-shirt. Make sure you are not cutting your t-shirt. Oh. So you trim, you need to make sure you are not cutting your t-shirt. I, you see the way I'm emphasizing on it. Sorry, let's bring this out. Cut with me. Please be praying for me so I will not cut this t-shirt though. Because even me, I'm scared. So we are doing magic, magic, magic. Clap for me, one part done. So now we are going to cut like this, like this, like this, but let's start from this edge. Please be careful you don't cut your t-shirt. Be careful. You need to be very, very, very careful because this is a delicate stage. If you cut the t-shirt, you have to start all over. And that's, that's a loss, basic. Basic. So you need to be very, very careful. You have to do it like your life depends on it. Mm -hmm. So you need to be very, very careful. So and let me quickly tell you this. For instance, if you want to cut this part, let's assume this is the part you need. Don't cut that exact part. You need to come forward because by the time you are cutting, the scissors is pushing the stone. Let me show you what I'm saying now. See, assuming I want to cut this part, I will not cut this exact part. I will bring out my, my scissors because it will push the stone. See. Please be careful, because even me that I'm doing this, I'm being careful, so that I will not cut my, cut my customer face. So we are still having some messes here. We need to trim it off.
Yes. So the reason why I did not remove this protective sheet, it makes it easier when you are cutting. If you don't, if you remove this sheet when you are cutting, the stone will just the scissors. See, let me sh let me quickly show you something. Let's assume the protective is off and I want to cut. The scissors itself is attaching to this um, because this place is sticky, so you will not be able to cut freely. See. It's not even cutting. Sometimes the gum will be affecting the scissors. It's not allow it to go smoothly, and then this, uh, the thing, the stone will scatter. So that's the essence of leaving this protective sheet before you cut it. So now we are going to trim this piece off. The next thing we are going to remove this. You can cut for assistant too. So you remove this. And then you place this back. Don't worry, any part the stone did not get to. You are just going to use your hand to fill it in. Okay. See, we have some essence here. Okay. So we'll trim this part. Please, you need to be very careful when you are cutting. So all this part, I can decide to fill it now. You use your, okay. I think this one will work for this part. Let's use this for this part. This, this one to fill this part. So the process continue. We are going to trim it out. Please be careful. Be careful. Don't say I did not tell you. Mm. So you cut. So now trim this part and then trim this off please be careful be careful when you are trimming and again don't be panic it's very easy it's very easy don't say hey can i do this thing you can do it if i can do it you can do it. So you need to be very careful. And then you cut. So this part now, we have to use our hands to fill this part. So we remove this. This one, I can use it to fill this place. I guess we should build this one first so that we can know where to patch it in. So, same temperature, same time. Okay, for those that are watching this video for the first time, we still you need to go back and go and watch the first video on how we supplement. We'll talk about the temperature, we'll talk about the timing, and we'll talk about the different type of machine that we have. 
This is 80 by 100. As you all know, it's so big, gigantic. <laughs> They're still bigger one. Okay, now let's go. Put this ready. So we are going to fill these other parts. <laughs> 